Listen, I don't have a lot of time. Can we get this over with? On the 2014 Big Bertha Alpha Driver, I was in Randy's bag from 2014 to 2017, and during that time, he might have hit three fairways. I don't know. Now, I'm not just here to dog on the guy. We hit a lot of great drives. I mean, we spent three years together. But I think his Napoleon complex got the best of him when he ordered me with a speed of extra stiff shaft. Besides, he had no basic understanding of my gravity core. I spent about a year in Randy's bag. I don't understand what this guy's problem was. I consistently produced 265, 275 yard shots off the deck. And what do I get from my efforts? Tossed in the trade barrel. We're the Mizuno MP15 irons, and we were in Randy's bag for a little over a year, which was a total nightmare because this guy reshafted us, he changed our line angles. I mean, he acted like it was our fault. I'm not sure if you talked to the Alpha driver, but he put X100s in us, which is ridiculous considering I've seen more swing speed from parents pushing their kids on the playground. I'm one of three Ping Glide 2.0 wedges, and I was in Randy's golf bag from August 14th, 2017 to March 3rd, 2018, and I just, I just really miss him. I'm the TaylorMade Spider Blade Counterbalance putter, and I gotta say, there's, there's no reason on God's green earth why that man should have had a 35-inch putter in his bag. <laughs> He's built like Frodo Baggins. Hi, I'm the Ping Hoof of Vantage, and getting rid of me was the worst mistake Randy ever made. Look, we can go back and forth comparing data between me and the G400, but at the end of the day, I go every bit as far as that turbulated abomination. And of course, Randy keeps talking about how great the G400 feels and how accurate it is. But have you ever watched the Remax World Straightest Drive Championships? No because it's all about that boom, baby. Now, I'm not trying to start trouble, but I've got it on pretty good authority that the only reason he switched to the G400 Faraway Wood is so he'd match his driver. So I guess if you don't care about performance, you only care about looks, this is something you'd do. If you're an idiot. How in the world do you go from hitting a grain flow forged iron to playing a cast club with a polymer insert? Because that's what he did when he changed the ping eye blade. Stamping blade on that iron is like putting lipstick on a pig. You're still kissing a pig. And for the record, the only reason he knew to bend him a degree flat is because of crap he put us through. You're welcome. I just, uh, I just really miss him. I think that once he realizes that all the extra spin he's getting from those Callaway MD4 wedges is just messing up his gapping, that's, that's when he'll come running back. To me. It's gonna be so good. I'm just saying, when you're 5'7 with shoes on and have arms like an orangutan, you got no business using a 35-inch putter. You know, I, I I don't care if I'm counterbalanced. What are you gonna do, choke up to my steel? You can keep your 31 and a half inch custom ping Karsten TR 1966 putter. You know, you, know, you should have just saved your money and cut down a Prodigy Junior putter instead. I have nothing to say to Randy. Besides, you're an idiot. What were you thinking getting rid of me? Both my stand legs still work, I have no tears, and my retractable strap still goes zip. Which was your favorite feature? You can take your new hoofa bag with your fancy logo and shove it. I invented what's in the bag. Without me, it'd be what's on the ground. Can you stop following me, please? Look, they can say whatever they want to say, but the reason they got replaced is because they're inferior equipment, okay? That's all I have to say. Can you step back from the 06 Accord, please? Thank you. He is a total ball whore. Yeah! He's a whore. Oh, you ask me, the guy's a fair weather fan. I mean, 2014 to 2017, I'm collecting dust in the back of the closet. And 2018, well, what do you know? Guess who finds their way back in the trunk? I'm just saying. I was never in Randy's bag. The guy never even took me out of the plastic. He had this Callaway X-Hop Pro Hybrid that he used as a three-iron replacement. Why would you even order me? I mean, at least turn me into a belt buckle. Or something. Randy can play whatever clubs he wants to, but at least when we were in the bag, he never got beat by his dad. That's all I gotta say. What's up? Uh, Randy obviously doesn't know jack about golf, because if he did, he would've put me in his bag, because I'm the best driver ever on planet Earth ever. You guys wanna buy some speed foam? This is how I spend my free time.